Are you in the mood for pulse racing action scenes, romance, comedy, and law-defying movies, but don't know what to watch? Well, look no further, because I've got not just that, but also mind-bending thrillers and heart-stopping explosions, making this collection the perfect treat for you. So buckle up and let's dive into the top five best movies to watch on Netflix in 2024. Starting the countdown at number five is Irish Wish. What the? Oh! Huh? What a fantastic movie I got to experience. Lindsay Lohan's return to our screen adds an extra layer of excitement, which is perfectly complemented by exceptional cinematography from the director. This film has everything, a love triangle, magic, a wedding, a cute meeting, and even a rainstorm scene that brings back memories of classic rom-coms from the 90s and early 2000s. Irish Wish follows the story of Maddie, a book editor who secretly loves her boss, Paul Kennedy. Things get complicated when Maddie's best friend Emma starts dating Paul. Right before Emma's wedding, Maddie wishes for true love with an ancient stone in Ireland. The next day, she wakes up as the bride-to-be. While preparing for her own wedding, Maddie meets James, a charming nature photographer. Sparks fly between them, leaving Maddie torn between Paul and James. Will she choose her boss or the new man in her life? I read a comment online comparing this film to a mix of Freaky Friday, Maid of Honor, and My Best Friend's Wedding, and I completely agree. Irish Wish combines the best part of those movies. So if you're looking for a lighthearted movie with beautiful scenery, catchy music, and a good story, Irish Wish is the perfect choice. Coming in at number four is Kill Me If You Dare. Congratulations, you almost killed your wife. I think there's a question that almost everyone wonders about. What would you do if you won the lottery? Just asking that question can make you think about what you'd do with all that money. But what if you were married and things weren't going so well? The story follows Piotr and Natalia, a married couple dealing with financial struggles and a rocky relationship. When they win a million dollars in the lottery, things get even more complicated. Natalia makes impulsive decisions without talking to Piotr, while Piotr keeps the winnings a secret and brings home the cash. Amid their growing tension, they start suspecting each other of planning murder based on advice from their best friends. With such a talented ensemble, this movie is undoubtedly a must-see for any film lover. Coming in at number three is 60 Minutes. This movie stands out from the usual action films we see these days due to its well-executed action sequences, which feel realistic, and the story itself moves at a good pace, with some emotional moments thrown in. The story follows Octavio, a mixed martial arts fighter who has only 60 minutes to reach his daughter's birthday party or risk losing custody. However, when he prioritizes attending over a scheduled flight, he becomes a target for dangerous criminals. Octavio finds himself in a frantic race across the city, trying to make it to the party and secure his daughter's future while evading the criminals on his trail. So if you're in search for a movie with well-crafted fight scenes, intense hand-to-hand -hand combat, and a fast-paced storyline filled with tension and excitement, this one is definitely worth watching. Coming in at number two is Pain Hustlers. Eeyore is he losing his shit. Hey, get the shoes off! Get your shoes off! The actors in the movie did a fantastic job, and the story kept me hooked from beginning to end. What's awesome is that it's based on a true story, showing how people always want to succeed. And the movie's visuals and overall production are top-notch too. The story follows Liza Drake, a blue-collar single mom who recently lost her job and is struggling to make ends meet, until a chance encounter with pharmaceutical sales rep Pete Brenner pushes her into a more financially stable but ethically questionable situation. Juggling her increasingly unstable boss, her daughter's worsening health condition, and her growing awareness of the harm caused by the company, Liza finds herself confronting her choices and struggling with the consequences of her actions amidst desperation and greed. And did I mention that Pain Hustler is directed by David Yates, the very person who directed the Harry Potter series and the Fantastic Beasts? That alone makes this film a must-watch. In the top spot at number one is Heart of the Hunter. Where's my son? With Netflix's 
unreliable and unpredictable algorithm, it's amazing that I stumbled upon this South African action thriller gem. While Heart of the Hunter may remind you of John Wick in some scenes, the film stands out with its own unique flavor and a compelling action hero at its core. The story revolves around Zuko, a former assassin now leading a peaceful life with his girlfriend Malame and her son. However, the past resurfaces when his old friend Johnny seeks his help. Zuko discovers that corrupt politician Dazam Tima is on the brink of winning the election unless incriminating evidence is revealed. Meanwhile, journalist Mike Ressler and his intern embark on their own investigation into Mtima's unlawful activities, risking their safety to uncover the truth. As Zuko races against time to fulfill Johnny's mission and shield his family from Matima's threats, he realizes he must confront his past to safeguard their future. This film refreshes the action genre with its unique hero and setting, making it a great choice for your next movie night if you're in the mood for some thrilling action.